welcome back to the Power of Five. Today we're going to be covering wolf teeth, one of the advanced weapons on the Ungaquen system. This is, weapon is very dangerous, we call it the maze of distraction. You go one, you step in, you block with the mace, you block with the bottom part, you smash. You shoot forward, seize the position of your hand, poke, shoot, flip, grab, and you go one, two, three, turn around, you hit, four, you smash. So the next momentum, we're going to be working on how to rotate this, the maze of destruction. And like I said at the beginning of the video, uh, just a quick re uh, recap. Uh, keep in mind that sometimes you're going to see this weapon a little bit oval, more oval, and the spikes a little bit thinner, or sometimes the spikes a little bit thicker. The reason being, though, if, this, if they're thinner, is to penetrate, you know, faster and to jank it up faster. When it's thicker, obviously, it penetrates as well, but it has a little bit of more trouble taking it out. So keep in mind that the maze was meant to, this, to take off shields and all that kind of stuff, okay guys? So here we go, we're gonna go with the next momentum of, of rotating the wolf teeth. This looks pretty, pretty savage. Anyway, so here we go guys, so this goes it's something like this. So you're gonna twist with your back hand this is the momentum of the backhand. And as soon as you twist with the backhand, the opposite hand is gonna do the momentum of the snake like we talked before on the, one of the videos. It's this momentum here. So from here, it's gonna go inward and then upward. Inward, upward. So from here, it's gonna go inward. Inward, then upward. Inward, then here. As soon as you feel it on your forearm, upward. As soon as you go upward, that's gonna give the extra rotation to the, to the mace. Now, if you keep it low, it's not gonna go down. So you're gonna add the rotation of the wrist, the rotation of the form, and the angle of your mace. The higher it goes, the faster it will go down to the mace, to down, all the way it goes down. So on this momentum, the opposite hand is just guiding the rolling down of the weapon. So when it comes all the way down, that's when you finish on your momentum. So let's do that one more time slowly. Back hand is gonna do the initial twist. Okay, the second momentum is gonna be the thrust. So you're gonna put those two together. One, one more time, one. One more time, one. Then from here, once you get this momentum, you're gonna add the second moment, the third momentum. So this is the first one, this is the second one. The third one is one and two. So it'll be one, two, three. Again, one, two, three. Again, one, two, Three. Again, 45 degrees. One, two, three. Last one. One, two, three. Step four. Step four is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, if you notice, one, two, three, Four, and it's already rolling to finish with the attack. 